I'm teacher Patty and I'm a teacher from Options for Learning and this week um, I did a story called Brown Bear Brown Bear What Do You See and it's a very easy to read story it's uh, repetitive so it's easy to learn and your child can read along with you they can identify the colors of the different animals they can identify the animals so it's just very simple and it repeats itself red bird red bird what do you see i see a yellow duck looking at me and then yellow duck yellow duck what do you see i see a blue horse looking at me so it just identifies the animal and its color so a fun activity that you can do at home is using a magnifying glass if you have one if you don't you don't need one you can always use a toilet paper paper towel roll not toilet paper paper towel roll uh mine's not done yet so i still have the paper towels but once it's done you can use the cardboard center and you can just look around the room so you can e either use magnifying glass if you have one paper towel roll if you have one or you could just use your hand and make it like a telescope type of thing um, and basically you play a game kind of like an eye spy with my little eye and you identify objects in the room so for example your your son or daughter can say you can ask him Johnny Johnny what do you see and so he'll look around and he'll identify an object and he'll identify the color so he can say I see a red ball looking at me and so then it'll be your turn mommy mommy what do you see and then you will identify a color and an object I see a green chair looking at me and if you don't want to say looking at me you can say that's what I see because that's what the story says look looking at me but you could always change it and say Johnny, Johnny, what do you see? And then he can say, I see a blue telephone. That's what I see. So it's just a fun way to identify colors, identify uh, objects and learn new vocabulary. And, and it's, you're taking turns and it's repetitive and language will be developed because it'll be saying sentences even though they're just having fun and looking for objects and saying kind of like a almost like a song it could be like a song or just a repetitive phrase so it's just a fun way and an easy way that you can do that at home with your child so till next time bye <laughs>